Hello, and today I'm going to teach you how to use our own SMS system called Autobot. Okay, first thing first, you need to go to our website called systemautobot.sg. Okay, once you are here, you need to click re register. And then once you are here, you need to type in your information. Your company name, brand name, your name, address, city, email, phone number, state, and postcode, part, and also password, and your country. And remember to click this, I agree. You need to choose what is your average marketing and advertising fee. Okay. So, after you are fill in all the information, just click register. And then after you register, you, re you need to log in to your Autobot account by typing your email and password. And also remember to type in this calculation just to confirm you are not a bot. Okay, and now once you are logged in, you will see your dashboard. Okay, you can also top up credit by clicking here, organization, and then click my plan. And after that, you click SMS. So this is the credit, and you can select the plan you want, and then select buy now. And then this is for the email. Okay, that's it. Okay, right now let's create a contact group by clicking contact and then create contact group okay after after clicking contact group you need to create new here okay enter your con contact group name like this and then create so after that after you create your new contact group here in here you need to import your contact information by clicking import and then after that you will see the excel file click it okay and then you will need to upload a excel file in here choose file so if you don't have a sample, you can download the template file in here or you can create your own CSV file. So you can you can see the instruction in here. So column one is name, column two and three is email or phone must be either one has input phone number and must set with country code like plus six zero in Malaysia okay and the column four is for birthday date okay the format for the birthday must be year and then month and then day okay after you after you select the file csv file you want to upload okay you can click choose file and then choose the file you want then upload okay right now after you are upload if you wish to modify it you can click here you can modify your group name you can also delete your contact group by clicking here delete and then you can delete it. if you don't want to import your csv file yet so you you can go to contact list contact list okay and you can create new contact list so select the group that we made before test group enter the name enter the email and enter their phone number yeah like this
okay so after that if you prefer if you want to modify the phone number email and the name so you can modify in here by clicking this modify so you can modify in here and update remember to update after after you you are finished modified okay so if you wish to delete uh, your contact you can delete by clicking here delete and then delete okay okay right now let's create a podcast by clicking marketing and then you click sms podcast okay after you are in the sms podcast you can click create new by clicking here okay in here you can enter your message that you want to send and then you can set a date and time Okay. And then you can select the group you want to send and select your email and then click create after you finish you create your sms broadcast okay it will show it in here and then you can click <coughs> and then you can click modify in here and then you can modify however you want okay and then you can create a report and you can see the report below like how, how many people send, how many people accepted, how many error okay in here and below you can see your report okay right now you can also delete your SMS podcast by clicking here delete okay you can also create email broadcast by clicking here okay after you are in the email broadcast you can also create new and type in the message you want to send okay your title your email broadcast title and then your select the select the group you want to send and you can also set time time and date okay and your email so create after you have create your email broadcast you also can create report and the report will showing at below okay and you also can create modify you can modify the email okay. and you can also delete it by clicking here okay so that's it for the autobot tutorial okay, below here we also got user manual to help you guys out okay so that's it thank you